Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day, a rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. And this must be amongst the favourite arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, I think we know what we're in for, whatever the circumstances that exist when these two meet. Losing really isn't an option, making this another intense, feisty clash, which should keep everyone on edge. The fans are more nervous than the players, to me, confirming an atmosphere of, of angst. Try telling them there's nothing riding on this. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, the goalkeeper, Wojciech Szczesny, Peter. He's got incredible reflexes, and that makes him one of the best shot stoppers around. He's also very comfortable when he's under the high ball or coming out for crosses. And having someone like that, just easing the pressure on that defence, can, can spread confidence very quickly. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Danilo very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Well, I'm a believer in having faith in your ability, but he's overdone it there. Bentancur. Chiesa. Bernadeschi. Alexandro delivers. That's gone a long way up and away. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. It's been a pretty frantic start. A lot of front foot press. And the finish! A possession this but very little to show for it and needless to say he was expecting a better ball than that Chiellini. and they are working very hard to get it wide now Jim yeah I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line it's uh, it's where the room is Taps it out No goals as yet. Plays it out to the wing. Checo. Decent looking ball. Chance to break. Alexandro. And a foul. Yes, the referee's given it.
Played out to the right. Danilo has come steaming up from great lead. He's done very well to get to that. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. And the through ball is intercepted. Alexandro. Chiesa. Alexandro. A really good feat from him. And it's played forward. And now the breakaway. Chiellini. And he's certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Lolo gets it away. And it's Quadrado. And we've reached half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score nil nil. Underway again. Nil nil then, and we're back on the way. Quadrado finds himself eased off the ball. Gets one in. Cleared away. No, that is pretty much the end of that. Alexandro hoists it forward. Now it's Morata. Martinez. And now they can launch a counter. Oh, man, he sorted that out. It's on the plate. Oh, I won't defend it. That had to be done. Chiesa. Chiesa goes looking. It's Danilo. That is terrific skill. Quadrado. Just got rid of that.
Juventus making consecutive changes here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Out to the right, Correa. Tries to get it forward quickly. Correa's cross. In comes the corner. Round. Ericsson goes short. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Alexander goes for clearance. Stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches, satisfied by organisation and solidity. Little cutting edge at either end, and it finishes nil-nil. The end of the game. Reflections? Yeah, I think the first thing to say is that the draw was about the right result. It had everything you want in a clash of this nature, the commitment, the passion, great ebb and flow to the game, and I think everybody can go home with a, a little bit of satisfaction from this. Well, that's it for tonight's match, so it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me.